Hey, I'm standing on top of uh, Masada, the ancient ruins where King Herod fled and where uh, he, uh, Jewish zealots um, uh, were eventually overtaken by the Romans and, uh, you know, a thousand folks died up here in this ancient ruins uh, outside of Jerusalem uh, in the Dead Sea. And as I stand here, you can see behind me the wilderness um, and the rock of this part of Israel. And as we walk around, we actually hiked up Masada this morning early before the sun rose. It reminded me of Jesus' temptations in the wilderness. The you know, devil brings him out here where it's barren and says, Hey, you know, this can be all yours if you just bow down and worship me. And do what I say. And I, and I think to myself that many of us walk in a wilderness, may not look quite as barren as this, but nonetheless, uh, it's rocky and it's hot. And we don't often know where we're going. And it's easy to be misled, to be misguided by voices that want to come at us and promise us something that just isn't true. But Jesus, um, you know, Jesus did not sort of buy into the temptations and he stayed focused on that relationship he had with God and knowing that the relationship with God will get you through any wilderness you might be in. So may you um, continue to trust in that faithfulness, even as you walk amidst the barren, rocky, hot deserts of your life. We'll see you Sunday.